Welcome to Electroline. To get a feel what the sources are for electricity production in some major industrial countries, I took three. I took the United States, the United Kingdom, and Australia to compare. And notice that for the three countries, gas, coal, and nuclear are the three most predominant sources of electricity production, accounting for at least 80% of each of the three countries. Now, it turns out that Australia is not a big proponent for nuclear power because they have plenty of coal and gas, and so they produce most, 86% of their need, by just using coal and gas alone. And surprisingly, 73% of that, almost three-quarter of their electricity production, relies on coal. But for the United States and Great Britain, notice 64% is coal and gas, and 59% for the United Kingdom is coal and gas. Add to that nuclear, and you're above 80% of the production of electricity just on those three sources combined. For the rest, there's still a fair amount of hydroelectric power being produced, 6.5% for the United States, 1.4% for the United Kingdom, and 7% for Australia. And then we have some wind power, solar, and biomass. They're starting out very slowly, but they are building up as we're building more wind production capacity and more solar production capacity. It's a slow start, but presumably these will continue to get bigger as the years go by and begin to eat into those other non-renewable sources. But that's what's currently going on in those three countries. It's kind of interesting to see where we're at, and we'll see in the future where we'll go. That's the way it is today.